and that little plus one gas pump. We bought all three of those for $15. And then I found this. Actually, I found that first, which is an old jigsaw that I picked up for $5. I don't know who makes it because the labels are gone, but it's a pretty neat one. It even has a quick release for adjusting the table. And then we got this box of ratchets and sockets. There's a Thorson ratchet in there. There's an SK in here. There's some interesting stuff inside of this box. I paid $20 for the whole box. Now take a good look at these. These are all brass floor knobs. Now that you're not looking, it's so it's hard to find them. Five bucks. Can't really argue with this. Whole box of them. Look at that. It's going in the garage. The last item, we stopped at the ReStore, the Habitat for Humanity, and I bought that chair for the garage for $5. It's ugly as hell, but I don't care. It's just going in the garage. And it's comfortable. Yeah, it works. It's better than that little fold-up director's chair thing that I'm using right now that Barbara, <laughs> Barbara went pocketbook crazy today. And they got a whole mess oh, of pocketbooks. They're hollow. That's why they're light. Uh -huh. yeah. But there are I got that ones. box they're over there of purses for 10 bucks. Yeah, and this great big bag and everything that fell out of it. <laughs> a bunch of different stuff. All right, so I went flea marketing yesterday. Picked up this little gas pump, about five and a half inches tall kind of interesting looks like it and feels like it's made out of some type of porcelain also got this lantern right here oil or kerosene lantern one and the same got a pair of those one of them is currently with my husband being restored I'm going to be I'm going to finish up this one also got a whole box of brass handles as well 55 of the handles. Let me show you one of those. There we go. Nice looking little Cut handles. The box for a really reasonable price. They asked for $15 for all of it. All of it. All those. All those, 30 of them, and the five flat. Very nice. Went a little bit pocketbook nuts. And as you can see, my cat's going to join us in our video. All right. Thankfully, she's not staying. So, handbooks, pocketbooks, bags galore. Let's start at the top up here. You see, there's a couple, an evening bag and a clutch. It's going to span across a whole bunch of them and slowly show you how many there really are here. There's got to be at least 35 of them. Originally paid $10 um, for one set and then found another one that had 10. So $20 in all that I paid for all of these pocketbooks, purses, wallets, and bags. I even wound up with some things from Similac here. <laughs> even got some thermos bags over there for your lunches. And just some regular beach carrying bags. This one's kind of interesting. It's just a little bag from a zoo. I don't even know if that zoo still exists. Riverbank Zoo and Garden. Look at all those purses. And I'm actually backing up so I can get them all into the picture for you. I even had to move my furniture to put it all in here. Just look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? 
and I got even luckier. I opened one of them up and there was three dollars in it. I actually paid seventeen dollars for all of these. All right, got them out of my living room and put my furniture back. <laughs> got them all boxed and bagged back up and in my office slash guest room and I'll be getting them listed and doing research on them all tomorrow. Isn't that beautiful those finds? Absolutely gorgeous. Very happy with everything that we got.